Hello there and welcome back to Cory Loses, where today we are once again continuing our Fall of the Republic 1.4 playthrough as the Galactic Republic. In the last episode, we ended with some uh, some unfortunate defeats, but we're gonna we're gonna bounce back. So I think we're gonna bounce first by sending Yolaren up. To, oh, never mind. By getting attacked at or attacking at Charos, uh, which I guess the CIS have lost to the Huts again. So. We don't want to get too mired down in this. Because uh, really, what I'm trying to do is whittle away a little bit at the uh, at the CIS. Because they're attacking us in a lot of places, and they have a lot of fleets, and uh, the huts are not my concern right now. So it'll be easy for us to take on most of the hut stuff when we need to, but that's that's not... That's not the thing we're doing right now. The huts can, they can stay here. If they want to attack the CIS with more stuff, then more power to them, I guess. Uh, but that's going to be an annoying wait. Where are you going? You're going down to Kashyyyk. Okay, that's fine. That was the direction I was going to send them anyways. Uh, I do have a Pathfinder that I put in this fleet, and we're going to go and try to take I see. some attacks on you. This fleet is coming back, and I'd like to send them back in there to get revenge for Talon. Uh, but I do need to clear out some of that. Unfortunately, the attacks have messed up our infrastructure a little bit. So uh, we need to spy on Charos and Bomas Cori. So Charos we're going to spy on and Bomas Cori we're going to spy on the next week as well. Uh, I guess actually what I'll do is cancel that out now. Oh, they got some more stuff in. Uh, I'd love to kill all that ground, all the ground forces. I think those got sent back from Charos. No, that wouldn't have been, that wouldn't have been there. Okay, well, first, Kuat, I need to cancel some of those here. I'm going to get a probe. All right. Because the, that CIS offensive took out, Almora had a lot of structures on it. Very sad. We're gonna have to make some plans to get away from that. Just gotta check that that's all working. Okay, we're good. We're good. They could treat potentially. Uh, what I'd like to do. Uh, I don't know what they have in reserve. Cause that's gotta be that's gotta be more than. More than 200. Okay, well, let's uh, let's let them make the first moves. Uh-oh. Oh, never mind. Okay, that's just the stuff loading in. What is wrong with my computer recently? All right, well, at least all the models are loaded now. It's some sort of RAM issue. It's got to be. Uh, okay. So if they're going to... Yeah, you send, send those all to safety... Send those ground units to safety. It's I'm. It's all safe over here. Fighters are going back. All right. So we'll pause and indeed send. No problem. Right, sir. Some of these I'll guys and they don't have any interdictors of their own. But we can Starting just kill a bunch of ground units. There's nothing we can't handle. That's all. What's at the front? Entering All right, we're not gonna want to have the actual fight here. We just want to take out a bunch of ground units and then leave. Very easy. Retreat in progress. There, we killed some of them. If this, uh, if they hadn't jumped in the extra units, then I'd be more willing to go for a bigger commitment here. But that's not gonna happen. Because I just don't know how much they had there. Oh, we killed a couple ground units. Okay, so we'll need to reposition you over there. We got you covered. Uh, you're good. Oh, I think also, like, taking Geonosis and stuff, that Building didn't help. Started. Financially, or infrastructurally. So we will need to do some more building up. So. Alright, get back to Camino. Yeah, that's the 538. I did know how much. I, I don't know what I was saying. 
Our improvements to standard clone armor have been completed. They're ready for production. Phase 2 clone types are available. Alright. Uh, they're coming to Argonar, which is back here. So that actually will be a hut fleet attacking. Unless that's the Trey or the Techno Union. So I'm just gonna... I'm gonna let that go for a second. Uh, we need... I think we need to hit Rusan and then we'll Let's come up in a circle around to Onderon. Because we're not in a good place. This is very not good. Delta frigate reporting in. What is wrong with Tactical my computer? Alright. I wonder if I just close any chrome windows. No idea what was open. All right, so this, uh, the hope is always to get more of the units, but if, uh, if I have to settle for killing all their structures, then I'll settle for killing all the structures. The more they're spending on structures, the less they're spending on units. Star Destroyer standing by. Star Destroyer reporting in. Get back to there. Your orders? Taking the offensive. And if we can, like, this is a, really, it's, it's a decent amount to to find yes, on a planet like this because it, it won't be a risk to our existing units it just means we get to to wipe out a lot more pretty safely okay that needs to die though uh, I mean as long as we take these out fast enough that is a lot that's coming into that Venator. But, yeah, we're still good. Their anti-fighter are doing the most. We can just send you off to the structures then. Uh, there we go. Alright, and you can get up to the Golan. So we're kind of just going to be going back to what we were kind of doing in the north. Where our our hope isn't going to be to conquer all the planets initially. We're just going to be trying to take out as many units as possible, build up our own infrastructure, and then hopefully get to a position where we can start figuring out which planets we want to hit first, or like which planets make the most sense to take out. It's a little bit concerning having Raxus where it is. Like, I'd love to just whittle that down and take it out, but that's not going to be possible with how big that fleet is right now. I just put, I'd just i put so much in into trying to reduce that that it's, it'd really distract from elsewhere in the galaxy where we're starting to be hammered a bit more. And the more that I'm able to... Uh, build up some of our own, like, high shipyard level planets, like Fondor, and then hopefully have a few more gaps where we can, like, lure them in and do some damage on defense. That'd be nice. But I can't really rely on that right now. All right, let's go around this way. Go to invade Camino. Okay, we knew that was going to happen eventually. Uh, okay, we got our phase twos here. Jump down there. And once we have a bit more money again, we'll have to deal with the command staff. Yeah, are you going to be coming from there, or are they actually on their way in from the other side? Well, we have a hypervelocity gun, we have a reasonable fleet. So if they do come from that side, if that is where the other 500 pop cap is coming from there, I hopefully will be able to beat it. But let's get you around there. All right. Because we know there's a large subjugator fleet in this area. But our fleet should be back at Fondor as well. Okay. Order confirmed. Full throttle, setting a course. Let's crush those. Fondor course. Anyone uh, Dragonfly, Iron Hand of Camino. Then get some PDF threads. All right, they do actually have... An ion cannon here. Uh, can I destroy that? 
before any fighters come out. There. Actually, their fighters might have already come out. I don't know. Awaiting your orders, sir. Ready for command. Awaiting your command. The lasers are our target. Okay, we'll check the chart soon. I don't think there's much point in checking it now because we're only killing small numbers of units. But if we can, if we can take out that whole. Uh, that whole fleet on Deveron, which I think is technically within the realm of possibility. Not a guarantee, but it's doable. Then that'd be a big swing for us. As you command. Go to invade Rhodia as well. They came to Camino. Right, I need to put a Pathfinder there so we can jump them in. But here we go. This is where that fleet went. Uh, that's 474. They're coming to Rhodia, which it's they can try to invade in space. That's going to be whatever it is. I'll cancel this. All right, well, we'll see what the hypervelocity gun does on top of the actual units we have. It's probably not going to be an outright win, and we don't have Kenobi on the ground for that either. Uh... Okay, we need to go with the HV gun on you. Because if I can get those both down, not all the way down, but... Get you guys up there. Like, we don't have anything super chunky in this fleet. That's one of the problems we're going to run into. Uh... We're going to try to move around a lot, though. Course plotted. Because the Lucra Hulk is a slow guy, and that's using almost half of their pop cap. Like, with this, that's over half of the pop cap they're able to have in the battle, which is why I'm not going to try to try to kill that Providence right away. And if we can get into a position up here where they have to kind of loop around, then they either have to come at us through there, or they have to come around and they won't be able to focus entirely on us at once. So you're going to stay alive for now. I'm going to do the same thing to you, and that's going to be most of their forces. All right, let's see if I can get some NTBs in here on you. Let's go on this one. HV gun. Y wings, come on in. This is Admiral All right, I'm just gonna turn around now. Captain here. And they just don't learn, do they? Watch your flanks. Do I have fighter support? Hold your position, sir. We okay, let's get to that. This is Admiral Yolanda. We're losing We're being overwhelmed. My shields are gone. Okay, they're still coming in. It will be a while before that Lucre Hulk's in. Uh, you're not allowed to get out of there. No pulling away. There, let's. If that's gonna come in, then let's uh, let's start getting it. And fighters and bombers, go for the recusant. You. Oh, sure, do that. I don't think that's a good idea. Okay, if you want to go for the station, that's fine too. Uh, okay, this is coming in. I can't hold it. I'm pulling out. Ah! They're jumping some stuff in the back. We need you to take them out. I don't know which I want to. Okay, get 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 back, get back, get back, get back. I don't know what I want to HV gun next. I'll let our ships kill the the Providence if it gets in close enough. If they have a bunch of weak stuff just floating around the battle in other areas, then that's fine too. Hypervelocity gun available. Okay, if you jump stuff in here. Why not? I might have been able to start getting the Looper Hulk that way. So maybe with some of our next stuff we'll hit the Looper Hulk. 
Laser bank has been lost. Commander, our shields won't I'm transmitting the coordinates to you now. Okay, Sir, we've lost another ship. Still jumping more in. Can we get around here? We've destroyed the Techno Union ship. Stop. Just turn around. And then... Now you go up there. And you go as fast as you can per ship. I think most of you will be able to avoid the... Uh, avoid the asteroids. So just keep going around there. I want to make sure we kill the Providences, but I don't want to waste... Like, I don't want to give them their pop cap back. We're still good on... Yes, sir. Uh, get on shields for everyone. Okay. They're getting some stuff to jump away. We need to get some of these fighters back. This is going to be a lot of bombers coming in there. That's all coming in behind us. We need to get these bombers. Uh, I'm, I'm going to start HV gunning that. Do I have more of you to maybe get in the back? And yeah, if the, the bombers are chasing us down. We want to make sure we kill them as they come in. Because that's the stuff that I'm really afraid of right now. That's going to be way too many hypervelocity gunshots to actually kill that. Alright. Alright. Keep getting those. And I think I have a couple more, so you want to get to the back. Oh, it's a lot of rockets that are going to definitely make it in, even if the bombs don't necessarily. What could possibly have happened since I last spoke with you? Alright. They're gonna mostly have to go around. That's definitely way too many bombs for us. Alright, I think we have to go. It's going to be too many bombers, and we need to get out before the engines are taken down. Okay, we didn't end up getting those providences, but we lost Claw of Iron, we got a lot of other stuff, and we can try to jump back in, because Rishi is right there, but let's, uh... Start this again. Safety check complete. Sir? We can get there before ground units do. We can have another run at it. Cause that was that was a lot. That was like a quarter of their stuff that they lost. It would have been more with the providences. I don't know if the I still think that's the core of the right idea. So, yeah, let's get you down here. All power to the engines. Republic light cruiser responding. And get as many of them to come down this way as we can. So we want you... Don't adjust. Just get shot. No, it's adjusting. Okay, well, that still hit the... It's something. Our Quintin's here. Copy it's a 389. That, that's basically twice what they have on the map. So I'm going to put you behind here. We're going to let them come around. We're on the move. For the Chancellor. And can I put one of you up here? I think his missile is going to go up there. Our 
So who's going where? We can ruin some people's days down here. Like we'd be able to drop on these pretty easily. Then if we just oh that that Ready could be good that could be good that could be good. All right, I think that's the plan. So commence flanking maneuver. Setting up my let's run, get in we... on this. Yes sir. Yes sir. I copy that. Engaging drive Moving thrusters. To light speed. On my way. Republic light cruiser responding. So to 389, right they'll be down 13, uh, about 50 that we're gonna get. Just cutting off this initial stuff. Oh, the the carriers did turn around. But if you're coming up here. Great. You're already going the other direction. Yes. There's 13 down, there's 23 down. Completely free. They're still jumping in on the other side. Okay, is that Luke Roll battleship coming in? If they only have that fighting us, then no, they're they're turning around on this. Okay, let's get the fighters in here because we want to make sure this cluster of bombers goes down. You know that's going to respawn. So. We should be able to take this early run. Okay. okay. Let's try to get those ones. This is it is a lot of fighters and bombers that we're going to struggle to deal with. Uh, but we can hit that one. And it is going to be a bit easier for us without the uh, without the enemy capital ships in here for the moment. Just being able to shoot the bombers and nothing else. Okay, I think it's still smart to just go after the Providences with those. And, like, if we only have the Lucre Hawk to fight. No, you, buddy, come on. If we only have the Lucre Hawk to fight, then I think we can kill it. But it's so many fighters and bombers that are coming in back here. We can't let them escape. Transmit orders. Plenty of supplies to go around. Uh. Okay, it's coming. We're receiving an urgent transmission. They are beating us with fighters and bombers, but let's uh, let's stop that and let's get our fighters and bombers to just do that. Uh, the rest of you start shooting that Lugra Hulk. Then they're going to be able to jump a lot in, so if we're weakened, it's going to be too much. Alright, I think we need to take them down a little bit more. We don't have the hypervelocity gun shot after this. Because they're probably going to get in with their ground forces. I have to let this happen. Like, I can't risk our units that much. Uh, Onderon, we got that one. I was hoping to use that southern fleet more proactively to help with this, but that's not going to be possible if... We've got a... Keep doing this in the south. Like if they're focusing on us again. They're gonna have a few units from the garrison, so there's a lot of the provinces down. Like what I'd really like for that other fleet down south is a lot more anti-fighter, which I want everywhere right now because that's so much of what they have. Is the fighters. 
All right. Okay, let's get bombers on that. Let's get you guys on this. Booting you. Get your weapons going. Nice to have a few battles in the middle where uh, we have the advantage. Like, if they're gonna... We can't fight strength to strength right now. Their fleets are just that much bigger than ours in most places. But if we can have... Some areas where we're getting in behind them. And we can even just... I mean, we can't fight strength to strength and do the whole fleet. We can knock down their fleets a lot more than they're getting out of ours. Uh, just send them down a few pegs. Well, Pelion's going around and killing stuff like this. That's basically plan A. Uh, we don't want to go to core to six for it. We have another fleet that can do some of this on Dalmora. So, you get down here, and you get down this way. Okay, so they actually did leave most of that fleet here, so we're not going to do that. Alright, how much is that? Is that big? That is big. Is it big in the way that I can't kill any of? I don't think so. Like, we have a Praetor, so we may as well go in where we still have a chance to get out. Okay, you guys are going to get this. You're going to get this. Like, we obviously don't want to fight the whole fleet. Alright. There's nothing saying we're not allowed to get a few kills and then uh, pop right out. Okay, like it's a big stack, so there's got to be reinforcements. Yes, Admiral. Cruising speed. We must That's what we must always keep in mind. Big stack, so what's in the back? We'll win this. That's that's how uh, th that's what Sun Tzu said. A lot of people claim they've read the the Art of War, but they don't remember that quote. So, did they really? Are they even jumping anything? Okay, they are jumping stuff in now. Yes, sir. Acquiring target. So we're starting to figure out what's in the back. Ready to update orders. Means you get shot and then we leave. Let's blow something up. Good shooting, sir. Time to die. Preparing for jump to light speed. Alright. Like, we know overall it is four times our fleet strength, or total strength, but that was a few hundred pop ago for them, and we've really only lost Outer Talon, so as much as that was a loss, I didn't want to take. It's one that we might be able to recover from. Did you already make it home? You already made it home. Raider, unrest on Geonosis. It's fine. It's, we just gotta finish building the construction. one structure there. As long as they aren't moving through, they might be doing. Under construction. Let's get in for the attack. Alright, Devron. Like, if we can get one more battle on Camino, even if it isn't going to be a win, I'll be happy with getting to use the Hyper Velocity Gun some more, because I don't think we're going to be able to hold the ground without Obi-Wan. They've lost Here's so many battles there. Okay. Uh, let's put a Mandator over here. Put Seardin in the Maelstrom. Then... Here we go. Okay, can you hit that? Probably not. Destroy that launch bay. Ready to deliver. Preparing assault salvo. It's so much nicer when we have the hypervelocity guns, but that's not a Your orders? possibility with these fleets. Main charged. 
I'll need to put a lot more of our money into anti-fighter for these guys. Ready for command. Moving into attack position. Changing course to intercept. We've got the Praetor as well. Because this is hitting the 200, or yeah, hitting 200. Almost exactly. Although, once we have some anti-fighter in them, I don't know. We're going to have some other some other space to open up. Okay, I think this could be a fleet where we can take down the Lucre Hulk fast enough and still get out afterwards. Especially if we can take advantage of that by weakening the Lucre Hulk and killing other stuff, but it, no, it's too much in reserve, so if we do get a Lucre Hulk down, we're just going to take it and go. Alright, fighter bays, fighter bays. Uh, you can get the clusters of hard points. I'm just going to click around, click around, click around. I think we'll be able to get this down fast enough. Okay, I'm not giving enough time. There we go. Alright, uh, right, I'm going to get you to kill some of the other support they have. Well, the rest of our units... Get the Looper Hulk? Or really... Other way around? Maybe? Yeah, we need to do this faster. So... I'll try to give a reasonable amount of time between the... I'm not giving quite enough. Maybe if I do two clicks each. Like I, what I'm trying to do is match up the the firing time with the uh, like the reload time with the amount of time that it'll take to with the amount of salvos rather that it would take to kill a hard point. There we go. Okay, we got everyone out. Don't want to risk it too much more because they're going to be able to bring in a lot of stuff. And kind of 415, which if we can go in one more time, they really don't have uh, much else. So that that's good. All right, there's some, there's some stuff that's going up to reinforce you. Four to six, like that opens up a lot of those for attacks that I don't want them to make. But, okay, we have infrastructure again. Let's get this all built up on ground. Geonosis is building that. Let's get hypervelocity guns on you. Uh, let's see how fast we can get some clones in on here. These ground units are just sitting nearby, waiting for their moment to strike. Okay, the Lucre Hulk... Five provinces. The Lucre Hulk is the big issue. But I think I need to just let the providences die rather than trying to You've got the captain. get everything down to a point where like I can finagle a win out of anything. We just gotta go for losses for them. Good. That actually hit. Splitting their forces is still worthwhile. Uh, so let's put an architect over here, SSV Normandy. That might actually draw some of them away. Alright. And... It's gonna come up here. Alright. So... I'm going to kill this. Yes, sir. You can just get up around. They're all going a different direction. Hyper velocity gun available. 
there. I just have to take the kills. Oh, that's uh, not the way you want to go, really. Fighters and bombers end up on the other side. Okay, you're you're in a rough position. I don't envy you. We're on the move. Full speed. Choose your reinforcements. And we're gonna get aquarium in here. Our aquarium, I think that was actually not aquarium. No aquarium. I thought it was an Arquitens one, but it wasn't. A punch. For the Chancellor. Right, we might be able to... You've got the captain. Our Quentin's responding. Do some duels against these guys? Republic Light Cruiser all power to the engine. Okay, that's all coming out there. What's our best bet gonna be? Well, okay. No, you uh, you just go Copy that, sir. around yes, here. Sir. We're on the move for the Chancellor. Our Quintins Pull responded. that as far away as possible. Our Quintins here, standing by. And now, can we do some uh, some little stuff there? Available. Hypervelocity gun. Where's that other Providence? Get him! Get him! We might be small. Okay, can oh, you two together, along with some help from Shacking Up move. and from Spearhead, maybe? You've got the captain. Engaging. Them. Here we go. Our Quintin's here. Right. You're gonna get down to the corner. We're moving out. Standing by. All batteries fire. Because they might be able to. Focus fire on that target. Get a, a small win. Prepare for combat. For the Republic. They're all going to be coming down here. We want to keep the fighters as occupied as possible for as long as possible is the thing. Copy that, sir. Engaging. All batteries fire. I forget what was in this fleet, though. Choose your okay. Reinforcements. Uh, I think we just have to Copy. pop in some extra help. Get some extra healing for you. The less we have something concentrated for them to, to look at, the longer before they really start putting everything together. You've got the captain. Our Quintin's here. Standing by. Yes, sir. Missile tubes loaded. Hypervelocity gun available. Okay, we are going to kill that Providence. No, don't turn! At least I don't think you've moved enough. Okay, good. Cannons charged. Get ourselves a... Unificent here. And I guess if we want to just kill this fire cloud. Okay, we're committed. I've got a clear path. Call for drastic measures. That's going to be a few of you coming in. We're as far as possible from that Lucre Hulk. Is one good thing, I guess. What could possibly and we got to get them. There's Dave P20 coming in. Your move, and... and... At your command. There. Yeah, now you got it! That's right! We might be small, but we pack a punch. So... They're gonna try to group. There's the other one of the other providences at least. All right, this group. Get you. We'll have at least a bit of point defense active in this area, so that's gonna stop the bombers from being as bad as they could be. But it's still it's such a small amount of anti fighter we actually have in here. I really want to kill all these little carriers, but I don't have the bomber capacity to just scout out to it. We almost have to go through the map a different way. Okay, well, we're going to get more of you down. 
Because they're only ever going to increase the number of bombers they have on the map right now. Okay, you got Shadow. Good for you. Because as long as those guys are back there, like, it's, it's almost just use the hypervelocity gun on those, but it wouldn't be as big of a problem if I actually had anti-fighter, but I don't in this fleet. I don't really any fleet. I'm not following my own video. You gotta do as I say, not as I do. Raise the shield. Okay, with nothing else to shoot at and with range not being that high, we'll at least be able to kill more of these bombers than normal, but the goal is mostly getting through to... to those providences. I don't think we can actually get anyone out. Well, I wonder if I can't do some hunting. Because some of you are going to be getting that. Okay, you guys are control group one. I'm not going to use my bombers as bombers. Okay, don't worry about that. Just get these. And the closer you get, the better it is. That's about to be hypervelocity gun to death. Uh, a lot of bombers that they do have over here are not really able to do as much about. Copy that, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, I think we're just going to go for this, and then we got to rely on the hypervelocity gun getting to that Providence before anything else does. Before it does too much damage. Yeah. Group one, get over to here. I think the bombers are gonna be doing too much damage there. So we're gonna lose this ack. Uh, is that even the case? We're gonna lose the ack, but like I'm not gonna need to worry about the others for a second. Mmm, the point defense is being a problem on that. Because there's not much that's coming up to us right now that we need to... Okay, let's uh, let's try to boost out of there. Nice. Trying to drag the... There we go. Alright, now you just go. Some stuff will die. Yes, sir. But we'll see if we can get through on that. Uh, hmm. There's still more coming in, and we haven't really cleared out as many as I thought we might have. And they're gonna start getting the. Yeah, they're gonna start getting the Lucrahulk in range too. So, I don't know that we can get more without losing more. On, what's being bombed? Yeah, everything's starting to lose shields. Maybe we'll get one more? I'd love to have the time to make a bunch of anti-fighter for this, but... Starting to not be free. Unit in production. 
Well, we'll have to deal with it that way. 227 now. They're not getting much else in. Bring her around. Okay. Well, that's going to come through. They're going to attack. He's heading to Mimban. What else can I get? Okay, well... Corellia doesn't have a shipyard. Where do I have a shipyard? I have one here on Coruscant. Vehicle in so I'm just gonna throw together some... TR-90s wherever I can. Unit. As long as it's not busy. Deco, you need a you need a shipyard. So Actually Corellia probably does as well. So you know what? Corellia Bliss, you're gonna go and give your homeworld a discount. You're gonna make Corellia what it wanted to be. Uh, but that is actually going to do it for today, I think. We have a lot of uh, a lot of work ahead of us. We've made some progress though, even if it doesn't seem like it. because uh, we went up one percent, they went down four. And now it's only three times instead of four times. But it's definitely a dangerous war. Thank you so much for watching, though. Hope you're enjoying the series so far. And hope to see you next time. Bye, everyone.